Hey everybody, welcome back. This is probably the last video of the weekly this week. I'm I'm happy to report. Um, again, like I mean, there was that one weekly where literally there was just like hurt animals, but no hurt triggers. There were like elephants, but no blowfish or camels or anything. That weekly was busted. This one, I just I just don't understand what's happening. Like I, not on a level of like the mechanics. I just, I, I face teams, usually in a weekly, this is all copium by the way, usually in a weekly, I face some teams that are stronger than me, and I go, okay, I see how you got stronger than me. Sometimes this weekly, not every time, but sometimes this weekly, I've looked at some teams and been like, I really don't get it. I don't know, where we were on the same turn number, how is every unit of yours a higher stance than every unit of mine? It just seems... I'm clearly missing something. That was the one thing you couldn't do. You could have buffed anybody except for these two. You chose to buff these two. You, you see? This is... I feel like I'm taking crazy pills here. Okay, I'll freeze a Hedgehog, because I, I... Genuinely, what did really well for us in the last video? Hedgehog Toad did pretty well. Honey Badger being moved up is not uh, good for business. But it is only a level 1 Honey Badger, so it, it's not that big of a deal. And Honey Badger itself, I think, goes it goes pretty well. Or it does pretty well, I should say. I do want to pill you when I get a chance. Let's let's give you some support. I'm still okay with that. Let, we're going to level you soon. Why don't you get out of here? Give some units some HP. Why don't you come into here? Why don't we freeze you? Not interested. Uh, honestly, even though I just buffed you, I would pill you as well. And then I would drop you down, like, right here. Maybe Maybe set it up like that, though. Okay, then we get a level up next time. That allows us to get a, a tier 4 unit. I love this for me. Dude, the Hedgehog is actually underrated this week. We level up and get a tier 4 unit. You would do 4 damage if I did this. Hold on. A deer. I think it's just very strong. We can give you a pineapple. The problem is it kills our badger. So maybe, even with where we're at, well, it's also going to kill everything else we put out there. It's true. You know what we can do? We can sell our badger and run a bear right here. And I'm genuinely, I'm not buying it for any form of synergy. I'm buying it just because it has good stats relative to the rest of the units that are available right now. And I, I would say it again. I would stand by it. It lived through the pineapple hedgehog, and now we look like a genius. We really, we really should. We should do this. We should do this. Then buy the super bear. Freeze you. Honestly, freeze a snail in this situation. Knowing we could get some easy stats out of it. I'm not saying we're going to get to 10. But maybe the best way to save ourselves from getting our you-know-what kicked in the late game is to just not ever let us get to the late game. <laughs> maybe that's the, the sauce. Oh, no. What the heck? My garlic, I overrode my own garlic. It's going to be the cause of and solution to all of life's problems. Okay, so we got to figure out where you're putting the bear. Because the bear has to at least, at, the, at a minimum, it has to be moved back one. That was like a, that's a throw. Sure, take a level. A moose. I feel like we can't not take a moose. You can go. And a moose will go, like, here's what I'm thinking. Give me the, give me like the double dip here. Sell me, and I'll take a 2-2 buff. I don't know who you put it on. I guess you put it on a unit that you need to survive. So the beetle makes sense to me. And now the bear is not actually giving honey to anybody, but he is a 6'10", which is also coincidentally my height. Okay, don't be jealous. It's not even... Like, it, like, I'm just gonna say what other tall guys say. It's not even, like, that cool to be 6'10". Like, honestly, it's kind of an... It's, it's annoying, you know? Like, they don't make things your height. I'm always bumping my head on huge doorways and stuff like that. Okay, I want to keep you around. I probably want you to have garlic. For now, I feel confident. So I'm actually gonna... I'm just going to accept that we're getting the 1-1 buff from the moose. 
Because I would have no problems running like a giraffe right now. I it wouldn't even dawn on me that it's a bad idea. So why not um, just run this? We're betting on ourselves to win. It's not going to work. But we are going to draw. <laughs> okay. So I'm okay with that. And even though the deer needs a level, the moose needs the level much more. Remember the importance of scaling this week. An octopus is an interesting idea, for sure. I really, I almost just want a toad. I gotta remember, moose level is very big. Let's freeze our tier four, too. You're at tier five. I would say, keep this. Rolling for chocolate. Rolling for chocolate. Unfreeze your tier. Unfreeze your... Keep your tier fives frozen. Just get rid of the tier four for now. Now we're leveling, we're, we're scaling two pretty important units. A level three moose would also go hard. I really still think we also just want a toad, even more than a level two deer. We want a toad to say a toad or so. What have you done? We're close. It's okay. It looks bad, but we're close. I feel like even the moose deserves a, a chance here. You're gone. You're here. This is the squad. And we even g get to give the toad some extra support. You know, I know this looks stupid. I really don't want to roll and screw this up. I'm confident we could do it. That's bad. That's bad. That's actually completely fine. And let's unfreeze these tier fives. So what, what's the next step? Level two toad might matter more than level three moose. It is a little faster to get there. Whatever, kill the snake. That's the important thing. It's not dead. My squad? No. We draw. Oh my god, it's unbelievable. Hanging tough, staying hungry. Let's go level two toad. I know we got a husky in here. We got way too many held foods to make that function. <laughs> Next step for sure. I mean, look, there's there's a part of me that says get rid of your hedgehog, run level two octopus. But we gotta we gotta find a way to make that make sense. Cause right now our strategy revolves around a toad getting to apply weakness to almost every opponent. Okay. Great minds think alike, I guess. <laughs> and yet we draw. Great name, by the way. Very creative. Four attack deals six damage. You know what? It's just we haven't used it much. Get you out of here. You come into here. Level me up. I would say don't roll. Ah, screw it. Let's roll. Freeze me. Roll me. That's not even that bad. Um, but we're still, we're looking for chocolate more than anything. And, and a pineapple, a pineapple would help. Level three moose, pineapple on the octopus. So you're saying there's a chance. So you're kind of like doing what the hedgehog did, but like a little worse. <laughs> but with the potential to be doing it better later. You see what the, the lengths I'm willing to go to? To try to get the 10 wins this week and it, it all just keeps falling just short. Okay, take a pineapple. So what are you doing else? So you're doing 8 damage to 2 random enemies before your attack. That's good. This is, this is solid, okay? You're not living long enough to make garlic worthwhile. Let's unfreeze like 3 of these. The main goal that I have there is just to... Uh, Maybe get a better chance of getting a moose in particular. Some sniping. Okay, my, my whole my whole squad falls apart. My raison d'etre, if you will. And yet, my god, out of out of the bowels of despair, we popped out a, a dub. A stegosaurus definitely seems to me like would I give up 2024 to add more stats onto our octopus? I you just don't or maybe would I give up the toad because the toad's getting sniped every time anyway? <laughs> I think so. I think our, our octopus needs the stats, man. This also gives our stegosaurus the stats unless we run it like this. I think this is the way we want to run. Even with even though the bear's effect will be useless for us here. No? You know, it gives us a tier six. 
It was literally just in the hopes that, I don't know, it gave us an octopus or something. Unfreeze three in the hopes of, or another stegosaurus. A stegosaurus would go insane. Like if we could get a level two stegosaurus, I'm still pouring one out from the moose. This hedgehog can't kill us. It can't kill us. Okay, hold on, hold on. where are we? That's seven? It's a long road, y'all. I'm not, um, not overly optimistic. I, d I don't really care about it. Oh, although now I'm thinking, hold on. If I sold my bear, ran a level two leopard that got buffed by a stegosaurus first, it would do, it wouldn't do that much, but it would do like 25 damage to two units. No, it would do like 13 damage to two units. I think it beats a bear. Is it better than the octopus getting to attack more often? It's a, it's a great question. I have to roll one more time. Holy cow. <laughs> do we sell the moose? I don't know. The moose is generating like some... It's like 24 stat points a turn. Get out of here. Get into here. I was really hoping you'd spawn a stegosaurus, but you didn't. So you would be getting... You're 24. And then what do you do at level 2? I gotta use my, my freaking head. 50% attack to two random enemies. For now... Well, what are you getting in behind? You're gonna get 12... You're gonna get 6-6. Six, six. Okay, I'm gonna give it to the leopard here. <clears throat> I am. We should move the... Yeah, because the beetle's probably getting maxed out now, right? I don't know if this is the right call. But it's, it's something. I've been weakened. That's an unfortunate weakness. However, however, I'm not running a pineapple anymore. And I'm not wearing hockey pants. Let's go. Okay. There's eight. I need a level two stegosaurus. Now you're basically going to be max HP. Max attack, which means you're going to do 25 damage to two units. Okay. And you know what? Your stats are going to be so high, you're going to need some garlic. I'm buffing the freaking ladybug still. What am I doing? Hold on. They got a very similar squad. We didn't kill anybody, but we did a lot of damage. And we're still doing a lot of damage. Okay, we draw. Get ready. It's, it, it's going to keep coming like this. Should have unfrozen some stuff in the shop last time. Okay, so you need to move back. Yes, this is, this is right. You're going to max out, like, this round, basically. Why don't you take some extra support, then? Why don't you take some extra support, then? And you're, you're maxed out on attack now. Looking for some chocolate? No chocolate? Pineapple, it just doesn't do enough. I'd rather have you have the garlic, okay? And then the moose, honestly, is pretty much at the point where it's fallen off. So I feel like you, you maybe don't worry about the fact that the moose uh, shop is no longer completely frozen. pain is this pain is this too much pain this doesn't seem that bad the crit didn't matter we draw these <laughs> we gotta unwind the moose we gotta unwind the stegosaurus right i think we could do one more round with the moose but i'm not gonna worry too much about the uh about the damage or i'm not gonna worry too much about the the shop i should say like i'll freeze a tier six i really want you to be on the squad this is important to me. Freeze me, freeze me, roll one more time. I would stop it right there, and I would say we buy, and we buy, and then we unfreeze all. Level three leopard could be the difference maker here. Next, we gotta move the stegosaurus into the, into the buff zone for the moose, if we're going to keep a moose. We killed a unit! They did kill one of ours, but we killed a unit. We're gonna, we're gonna lose this one. But that puts us on, no, we're gonna draw! <laughs> That puts that would have put us on one, but we're still here. I don't know about a microbe, man. I don't. I don't think I see it happening. No tier sixes. Roll me. Like a snake is interesting. Don't get me wrong. A snake's mighty interesting. Adding some weakness via the toad, but I don't see a world where the toad lives. I just don't see it happening. You're already, you're, you're maxed. 
we're now in like a world where I think the moose needs to get the Stegosaurus buff next, but maybe not yet. So give me some chocolate first. Freeze me, freeze me. I'll, I'll accept this as, as where I stand right now. You're maxed, you're maxed, you're basically maxed. You know what? Oh, I didn't mean to give you garlic, I meant to give you a cupcake. What am I thinking? <laughs> Three 50-50s with upside is not, it's not quite enough, man. Oh, jeez. Okay, bad round, bad round. We're on lethal. Would the stake have mattered? I don't know, because our moose gets killed at the start of the fight every single time. Freeze me. I'll freeze you. We just need chocolate, please. I'm willing to go to the ends of the earth for it. And, I, and, and that's how far I went. I went to the ends of the earth for it. Stegosaurus needs next, probably this round, but next round for sure if we live, needs to buff the moose. We kill the Stegosaurus. We're hitting some units. We're hitting some other units. We still get to attack. Oh, you got, you spawned another unit though. Oh no. Oh no, the Sabertooth. The Sabertooth is going insane. Their whole squad is still full. We continue to hit the Sabertooth. Please. Please. You're lethaled. We won a round. Okay. That was scary. <laughs> I just want... I just want a chocolate. Just single chocolate. A chocolate. Simple chocolate. Thank you! Thank you! Freeze me. Roll me. Move me. Roll me. Unfreeze, 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 unfreeze. So now the moose is basically... Now we got four maxed units, several of which have upside. And the sniper at the start. My god, I think it, I think it happened. I think our dream has come true. It's only getting better. Holy cow. Well, that'll really take it out of you. But honestly, it feels great that we finally concocted a dub. Thank you, Moose and Stegosaurus. Game one on turn 21. Okay, and then we'll just run one back real quick. <laughs> Horses and crickets, huh? And ants, and ants, and ants, and ants. Yeah, yeah, and ants. Okay, now I feel that that's a... Be a naughty alien. Like that lady from Species, am I right? Either way, I'm uh, I, I feel like that was important. We've like exercised the demon. I feel like I, I, I can tweet the gif from Cabin in the Woods of the Japanese uh, school child holding up the, the, the frog and going, the evil is defeated. Cause I, I finally, I felt like I was a little bit in control of the weekly this week. Or for the first time this week, I felt like I was in control. I'm just gonna put you right there. That was a, it was a tight dub. No question about that. We were unpunished for our order mistake here. That feels nice. And we're gonna win! How about that? I do kind of miss when we were winning early. Remember when we were winning early last time? That felt nice. Let's see if we can bring that kind of energy again. Elevin does have good stats, but I, I'm not sold on it. I'm kind of sold on, on what a raccoon did for us last time. I'm not sold on anything here, but go ahead and take a cupcake just in case. And Raccoon, I think, my perception of it was it does, it's at its best when... That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's a loss. Um, it's at its best when mods are no longer in the game. So it can, like, steal a garlic from a unit up front. This is probably not advisable, but... Here I go advising it. So here's a rarity. <laughs> I genuinely believe that it simply makes sense. I do. I do. I Because the nobody's going to have that much HP. This is like the one situation where it works out terribly for us. Also... Uh, I don't think there's any realistic chance we can pull back from this one. Oh wait, never mind. We're going to draw. Let's go. Um, 
it's it it feels like a hedgehog is guaranteed draw tech. And if I'm not that impressed with my team, a draw seems like a great outcome. Pill me, see where it lands. That's exactly where I needed it for this to feel good. And then honestly, for for one round, just toss me a swan, brother. And the swan is just there. That's all it's, it's just there to give us a gold next turn. It's a savings account. What do you got for me? A little ox? You're gonna spawn something? Oh no. Two, 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 two. Okay. I, I think we got better that last round. I, I genuinely do. I guess we'll keep the swan coming here. Not interested in any of this, quite frankly. Um, I'm, I'm a little interested in, like, a camel. I'm interested in you next round. And I'm interested... You know what? I'm interested in, like, you right now. Because I, I don't know if this camel is ever going to... I don't know if it's going to stick around. It's existing just because it can survive the first assault here. And I, I gotta tell you, I think you're gonna run me over with this garlic, brother. Although, hold on, the the raccoon saved us. Now we start going up against teams with held food. Maybe this raccoon is starting to do something. I would love to get a rhino going. I would love to stat up a rhino, dude. Sell me. I just feel like a. I feel like in my heart of hearts, it has the ability inside of it to go sicko mode. Let's put it to the test. I'm gonna. Let our swan get an attack, because I'm not a monster. I'm going to add some garlic here. I feel like, feel like you almost want... I, I know how this looks, <laughs> the rhino at the back. I feel like you want a raccoon to steal some garlic, if possible. So you want, the, you want it to be close to the front so we can steal said garlic. Now that the garlic's off the table, you let the rhino go sicko mode on the rest of the team. I'm not saying it's a soul read. I'm just, I'm just saying that that worked out very nicely for us. Now, I think some garlic on you. I, obviously, a chili or a pineapple in the future as well. Sure, sure. Just looking at what we got. I'll take my, my swan level early. We do have targeted foods. We do. I can't deny that. Is it possible we could scale fast enough with this? What would we sell to, to make it happen? I really don't want to sell our hedgehog. I would sell the swan to make it happen. I actually, can I be honest with you? I think you sell the camel to make it happen. Even though it's close to leveling. And then you run the seal and you freeze a food. You probably don't freeze that food. You need to make sure it gets targeted. It's a, it's a risk reward thing for sure, but I, that's, that's my risk and let's hope we get my reward. My hedgehog. I killed their toad though, that seems awesome. I'm stealing your garlic. We're drawing, okay, I, I can live with that. Now the scaling engine should begin. We have enough food to, or enough money to buy some foods. Sure, please hit my rhino, thank you. Please hit my rhino, thank you so much. This is a very weird team that we're choosing to run here. That's a just-in-case me. I'd rather feed you a guaranteed apple. Hit my rhino. Whatever. Good try. Honestly, good try. And now you can move back and the rhino can start to move forward again. Now, we could go husky, but this team is way cooler than what we were trying to do with a husky. Okay, steal, steal their garlic. Steal the chili. That's not how that works. It's okay. It's still a nice hit. And then kill him with the chili pepper. Goose lives. Okay. That's five. Keep it going. Rhino, thank you so much. Hit me, hit me with this, hit me with a rhino. Thank you so much. It's so worth. Fantastic. You didn't hit the rhino off of that, but you got hit by it. I'll take that. Level three raccoon. Look, I don't know if I see it happening. Leveled. We want to get chocolate and get a level two seal, and then we can start to talk, but... Okay, we're not stealing any garlic. We're not stealing any chili peppers. But we are shooting, and shooting, and then killing, and then winning. It's a very narrow margin every time, but it's, it... I'm excited. Okay, uh, buff me, obviously. Buff me, obviously. You even hit my rhino both times. Thank you so much. You know what we're looking for. You know what I want to see. I, well, first I want to see this. <laughs> first I want to... And then I want to... And I, and I, and I, and I, and I, and I, yeah. 
And then um, I still want to hit you with stuff. We still level two Rhino will go sick. I don't think we need to worry about the raccoon anymore. We may now consider that the, the hedgehog can go, honestly. It's been a very efficient unit for us. I'm going to steal your garlic real quick, if you don't mind. Thank you so much. I, I do see what you did there, and I'm impressed, and I'm proud of you. And you got me. You got me, you got me something fierce with that incredible elephant play. Well done. It's a bit of an unusual team. I got to give you some credit for that. It's not just brainlessly scaling with the husky. Please hit my seal. Thank you so much. I couldn't have asked for more than that. And then a second stegosaurus. Certainly feel like we could now talk about a lot of things, but this is one of them. It's a very scary looking team. And even the seal at the back. I mean, like, we can move the seal up. It's just kind of like, I, I, I don't know where I want to put the rhino, you know? It's not enough, is it? It's not quite. It's, it's so freaking strong. Okay, now this is just the husky team. I'm upset because I beat you earlier, and now you're coming back and you're putting me in my place, telling me that my team is not good enough, and, and you may be right. We're getting rid of the chili pepper because we need scaling. We're going pizza mode because we need scaling. We're going steak mode because we need scaling. And guess what? Now, now I'm rocking this weirdo team. Th that's the team. <laughs> that's the team. We steal the frontline garlic. Then the seal and the stego take care of any miscellanea just hanging around back there. My god, it worked. It worked to such a crazy degree we didn't even need our, uh, our rhino to do anything. Okay, chocolate is so spooky here. I think the thing we need off of chocolate the most is the level 2 stegosaurus, to be honest. That allows us to have an extra space to pop something down. And you're given 28-28 buff. I mean, on the rhino, that's going to go hard. The rhino, I'm going to take a chance. I'm going to give you a pineapple now. You do double damage against tier 1 pets? I didn't know that. We put a seal out there as a savings account. Was it worth? I don't know. But only time will tell, and only God knows why. Kid Rock. Little Kid Rock song for you. We can't win this. Are you crazy? Look at this. Look at this squad. Double, the level two poodle, level one poodle. Come on. Well, still, I'm happy we got our 10 piece. That, that eluded me for a long time. I'll be happy to see this weekly go, but I'm not happy to see you go. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. See ya.